Here are some example requirements from a NASA requirements document. Going across the columns from left to right, we can see there's a parent requirement, which is going to be a product requirement. And that product requirement results in one or more software requirements, the REC ID. In this case, the top row is SRS Software Requirement Specification 3.2.6.12. That means there's a lot of requirements here. And the next column is Requirements Text and Rationale. The software shall send data at a user data rate from zero up to and including 100 megabits per second. Below that is a rationale explaining why that requirement is important and what it does. The column after that is a priority, though some requirements will have higher priorities than others. And the last column is an allocation, and that is which subsystem or which functional block is this requirement allocated to, meaning that that subsystem is entirely responsible for the ability of the overall system to meet this requirement. 